Honestly, let's be real. The current administration is a joke at this point. Simply addressing the elephant in the room is not enough at this time, you know? What we need to do is we need, we need, to, we need to yank the elephant's tail and take its peanuts. Not just address it, possibly bribing it with like chocolate chip ice cream until it leaves the room for crying out loud. I mean, if we try to be nice, just asking to simply address the elephant in the room, those deconstructivist word manipulating sons of a bee gaggle are, are just going to put address on the elephant. You know, that's what they're going to do. What do you mean? We address the problem. We put, we put address on the elephant and it's, and it's, and, it, and it's, it's just, it's just go about their business. Then they'll just go about their business just like they normally would, spending money with their corrupt bureaucrat bureaucracy increasing and so on and so forth. I mean, look, putting address on the problem is not what we meant when we said we wanted to address the problem. Okay? And you know it. You know it at this point. This is ridiculous. I'm getting I'm getting sick of these games, dang it. That would be like that would be like SpaceX trying to launch a rocket into space and they say, let's do it. And then all the engineers start humping the rocket ship for crying out loud, like a, like a dog humping your leg. That's not what we meant, dang it. I, 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 could, get, I could excuse like a stupid dog for, for the miscommunication of humping someone's leg, but although I'm still going to smack it, right? Oh, you're cruel. You're smack. It's like, no. That's not cruel to smack the dog. If you don't if you don't smack the dog when it's humping someone's leg, you're doing it wrong. And it's not like a cruel smack, you know, from a place of anger. Uh, it's it's just a it's just a clear, crisp communication smack. That's what I'm talking about. But honestly, there's there's no excuse when when the people when the people tell the government, the people tell the government, get it done for for the government to act like they're as stupid as a dog. Right, because they, they they're not that dumb. The dog had the dog is, you know, stupid. Stupidity is not the problem here. Okay, deception and lies. Those are the problem, and those problems are inexcusable when you're a government public servant or department where your primary task is extremely high levels of transparency designed specifically to build trust, given the fact that you're given you know, this power and shit. I'd like, I, I'd say, I, you know what I'd say? I'd say try, you could try slapping Joe Biden, but, but I'm, I'm pretty sure you're just going to get that same blank stare after you slap him, right? There's not going to, crisp, clear communication is just not possible with that guy at this point. You know what I mean? And then after, and then you'll probably get sued for attacking a helpless old, old invalid man. Probably at the same time as they as they're as they're busy releasing the the whoever the latest Trump shooter is, while they pat him on the head, letting them know they'll they'll do their best to disarm the public, so that in in the future his attempts will be more successful possibly, and it's like hold on now, I w I was just trying to wake up the old man from his brain dead trance he's been in for the last four years for crying out loud, and how. And now how in the world can it be at the same time? They're telling me at the same time, number one, this guy's a helpless old man. And at the same time, number two, he's the current and active mightiest governing politician in the, in the biggest country in the world, battling it out with ruthless autocrats, you know, dictators and despots for crying out loud. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm all for pro providing first class, all expenses paid support to this guy and, and kind, loving support to anyone that needs help. But we need to realize in this country that promoting somebody to a stitch to a station they're not even close to being prepared to handle is not kindness. That's not kindness. It's cruelty, not only to the person elevated but to all those influenced by that person's incompetent decisions. And that second group of people is much larger than the first and where our compassion would most profitably be focused. Period.
Sorry, that's what they say at the gut. So that sounded that was my rant, that was my epilogue. So I had to do the period thing because that's what they do on the show.